first, congratulations to your medals and records in, in Rio. Great results and your big success in Schachtel also. And uh, I see in the, in the entry list that uh, you have entry for all events. Only a short question, why? <laughs> well, a short question, but why not? <laughs> uh, thank you for having us here in Berlin again. Uh, I love to be back here. Uh, you know, last year we weren't here, but I'm, I'm really happy. I really like this pool. I broke a couple of short course world records here before, so it's, it's nice to come back and, you know, bring those memories back. Um, I will be racing a lot of events, uh, so, so, you know, I, I love to get up and race. and. Um, that's what I did in charters, and I think it's an awesome way to, you know, get back into um, into training and racing again after after the Rio Olympics. But but normally it's so when you have the heats, you have the other it's two starts or something else, and you have a heat, and every five minutes you have another race. How does it feel? Can you explain it? Well, it, it doesn't always feel good, you know. Uh, <laughs> you know, in, in charters, my last event was actually the 800 freestyle on the first day. I, I had six events before, and I, I did cramp up for the last last 200 meters, and it you know it, it definitely hurts. But on the other hand, when I finish that day and I know I have so many races, I I feel a lot stronger and tougher. And the next day I only have six events that already feels easier. And then when I go to the Olympics and I only have the one race to focus on in the final session, that that really I'm able to focus in for that one race, and I know. For me, that's the easy day. You know, I already have done all that hard work before. You know, I try to prepare the same way as I, I did for Rio. I, I really feel um, still that motivation, determination uh, in me, and uh, I, I I want to you know represent Hungary the same way in Rio. Can you say that the preparation for Tokyo starts now? Or are you looking now to the World Championships next year in, in your home country in, in, in Hungary? Uh, you know, before Rio, I even said I don't think it's really only that four year is the way you prepare because I think I needed all those years before. Uh, so, of course, um, I have been preparing my whole life for it, you know. I think all we can say that all the ups and downs we needed, we needed the, you know, the age group swimming, we needed all that to be able to, to be here when we were in Rio, and it will be the same way for Tokyo. Um, so I'm, I'm continuing, I'm continuing my preparation for Rio. Uh, of course, the, the shorter term goal is, is going to be the World Champs, which will be in my, my home country, in Budapest. It's going to be super exciting for us Hungarian swimmers to to be in this huge stage in front of our, our home crowd. Uh, we were able to uh, be competing in front of the home crowd a couple of times for European championships, but I mean, Verdi is, is going to be a, a much, much bigger stage and it should be really fun. You won the, the World, <coughs> World Cup in the last four years, uh, the FINA World Cup. Uh, what are your goals for, for this season? Um, are you competing at, at all events or? Uh, most likely, yes. Uh, I, I, as I said, I really enjoy it. So, yeah, I, I definitely you know want to keep continuing what I've been doing.